You know, I've re-recorded the narration for this video like ten times, and I just, I, I don't know what it is. I just, I, I, I can't seem to get it to where I like it. I just, it's not the tank. I love the tank, or IFV, whatever you want to call it, if you want to be technical. Um, the thing is great. There's, there's no complaints. I mean, I got permanent camo for it. I got the, uh, the uh, battle hardened thing for it to turn it into a tier six premium, which is great, by the way. I would recommend if you have some extra money doing that for your favorite tanks, because what's better than playing your favorite tank? Playing your favorite tank and making a boatload of money. I mean, come on. Um, but uh, yeah, I mean, you got the nice auto cannon. It, does okay for uh, for damage in pen. It's not the not the greatest, but you got that twin toe. The twin toe is great. You've got smoke. You've got uh, APS. You've got ERA everywhere. I mean, it's it's very survivable. It's got good top speed. It's pretty maneuverable. There's there's just no complaints with the vehicle at all. Um, but I just I, I don't know. I just I, I can't seem to to get this this review the, the way I like it. So, it, <laughs> honestly, I pretty much did just review it, right there. The problem then becomes, you know, what do you cram into the other 12, 13 minutes of the video? Uh, you know, and honestly, I, I might I might not put anything in there. I might just uh, end the last game or so with, uh, with you know, just, just no, no audio. Uh, and look at this position right here. This is an IFV's wet dream. You know, just sitting up here, guys spotting down there so I don't have to spot, just lobbing missiles and getting damage. Look at that. Shot his pinky toe, full damage. This this is the greatest spot ever. Um, I'm playing with, uh, yeah, that other guy that you may have seen from my previous videos. Far. I call him Fargate because he's kind of a kind of a dick. You know, like, faggot, get it? Hi, I'm so fucking witty. But, um... <laughs> <laughs> uh, he likes to whine a lot, but it's it's whatever. Um, I really wish I'd got that kill, but I didn't. Oh, and then I noticed uh, I got Super Six. That's kind of a toxic player. Both Far and I have him on our ignore list, so we don't like him. He doesn't really back up uh, anything he says, and he just sits there and rages like a freaking five-year-old. But you know, it's, it's completely different from me, you know, the angriest gamer. I rage like a five-year-old, but I actually back up, you know, what I say and kill people. That guy doesn't. So, you know, I'm totally justified and in the clear, whereas he... <laughs> um, but he was platooning with another guy I know um, named Arnie, and I've... I've uh, I, I, I keep running into him in, in random games. It, this one right here, you know, I didn't even notice he was online, but he is, and, and there he is. Um, this video has been sitting on my computer for a while, and it seems like every time I jump on there and play, I'll run into him at least once, twice a day, maybe three times a day, uh, on the days that I actually play this, just randomly searching. So, uh, yeah, we usually platoon with him a lot. He's, he's pretty good. He, he, uh, he carries his own weight. And that's another thing. Carrying your own weight. Guys, seriously. A lot of the vehicles in this game are very good. They're very well balanced. All you've got to do is just position yourself a little bit, learn how to use your vehicle, and do your own HP worth of damage. Even if you die and your team loses and you do your own HP worth of damage, you're in the clear. No one can really bitch at you. I mean, they can, but then they'd be a shitlord and, you know, whatever. Oh, look at this little flank right here. Look at that. And boom. I don't really know how I got that missile in there, but I, uh, I did. Daka 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 right here, has been hauled down the whole time, just killing everything, and he's very difficult to hit. If I could see his gunner sight on the uh, the turret there, and he wasn't behind the uh, the dead tank, I, I would probably be able to throw a missile in there, but I, I couldn't, so I couldn't really get the missiles in, and the AP doesn't have enough pen to get him from the front, so I'm trying to dump all my uh, my HEI into him and, and get rid of him that way. And I'll happily sit here and dump my entire load of HEI into this guy if it'll uh, if it'll help the team kill him. But he's all alone now, and our guys are feeling courageous. So I think they charged up there and finally got in there. Yep, they did. There we go. Finally, he's dead. But uh, yeah, I'll, I'll go to the um, I'll go to the uh, the stats screen now, and you can see how I did. 
Um, I got Arnie in with us for the uh, the, the next two videos, uh, and that's another thing. This, like I said, I, I love this vehicle, so it's not just going to be the uh, you know the one video or whatever, and then we're done. I'm going to throw in two more after this. Why not? Um, but yeah, look at that damage MVP. Uh, I'm not sure. I don't think I blocked any damage because I only took that one shot there. Um, good money, as you can see. It's got that that uh, that battle hardened upgrade for the premium. What can I say? I love this thing. I don't regret spending any of the uh, the gold or money on it. Well, I guess we'll just jump into the next one now. It's, uh, this one I started recording a little bit late, but I got all the important bits. Um, and can I, let's, let's just take a moment here and just look at the graphics. I mean, yeah, with YouTube there's going to be some quality loss, but it's, it's not going to be a, a, a real big deal. It, it is noticeable from whatever you're seeing in 1080 to what I see on my screen. But even, even with that, I mean, this game just has... It's got better graphics than World of Tanks or War Thunder. Will probably ever have. The graphics in this game are... are I, I love them. Are they the best out there? No, there's probably some better things out there. But you know what? None of them are out there that are uh, that are really, you know, tank games or uh, free-to-play games that I actually have interest in. And... I seriously challenge Russia's ability to actually make a decent game with, with decent graphics. Um, but I, I just, I, I love them. Uh, oh, another thing, they got uh, day-night all-weather patterns. Uh, I think they have one where you're fighting in a snowstorm. They got a few where it's raining. They've got, they got, they got tons of different uh, weather scenarios in here. You know, they don't have that in either of those other uh, games. Um, Ran through there, and that Bradley must have saw me capping. Um, but I was gonna go flank those guys because her team's got them all tied up in the north, and I figured that's a perfect opportunity to flank and get some damage. I had HEI loaded because if a Bradley has uh, ERA, for some reason your fang rounds don't have enough to pen the front armor. It, I guess it's got just enough with the ERA, but the HEI will pen. However, it seems like the HEI isn't penning the side, but it'll pen the front, go figure. So I reload the fang rounds and the AP and, and you know, kill him that way. Um, and then I, uh, once he's dead, I, I just run over here and try to try, try to get some damage. But, uh, you know, our team's winning. I'm feeling pretty good. I'm feeling kind of invincible. And in before mistakes are made. I feel like I start shooting that guy. And kind of tick him off. Back up a little bit. And I'm not really hitting that. I thought that guy had his back to me, but I guess he didn't. Or maybe he did, and I just didn't have enough pen to, to get to the back of his turret. I couldn't really see at that range. Um, I'm still spotted. I'm coming up there. Now, no, look at there's an MBT right next to me fighting this guy. Does, does he freaking shoot him? No, he's waiting for me to come down. That's one of the things when you play IFVs. People hate your guts because you have an auto cannon. So they'll sit there and stare at uh, stare at you, and would rather let MBTs and TDs come up behind him and kill him rather than give you the kill. And uh, I freaking took forever to get that missile up and missed the Chinese tank completely. Uh, and right here, this is where mistakes start getting like ridiculous. I should have probably uh, kept going and, and flanked him. I don't know why I didn't. And then I deploy the smoke at the worst time ever, like a tard. <laughs> so, you know. I deserve, yep, I deserve to get a headshot right there. Um, uh, in my defense, though, for what it's worth, and it's honestly not going to hold up because that was just fucking terrible. <laughs> in my defense, this, this, uh, this is the day of the patch, and this is the first time the Chinese tanks have come out and that I've, I've seen them, so I didn't really know what to expect from them. They're, uh, they're a little bit more maneuverable than I was expecting. I was kind of hoping... Um, kind of hoping that uh, they would be a little bit less maneuverable, but um, it turns out they're not. And I really, really should have just got in behind them. I was probably still going to die either way, simply because I didn't have enough hit points and I didn't have enough uh, time to do enough damage to them, but you know, I, I could have done better. Heck, I could have even just backed up and then deployed smoke and gotten away, but yeah, lots of mistakes were made. So uh, I'll take you to the stat screen on this one, and as you can see, yeah, we did we, we picked up Arnie. Um, didn't get MVP, but you know it's it's whatever. Did good enough, carried my own weight. Actually, did more uh, damage than I had HP, so that's you know, that's good. 
Um, and if my team actually needed me to perform, I wouldn't have done something stupid like that. I would have probably uh, played uh, hide and seek or uh, outspotted them and lob missiles, you know, that, that kind of thing. But we had it, so it wasn't a big deal. Um, and see, look at this weather. This is what I'm talking about weather. This, uh, it's just so beautiful. I love the graphics in this game. Even for an alpha, it just takes a dump on World of Tanks and War Thunder. Or, sorry, beta. I keep saying alpha. Why do I keep saying alpha? Beta. Even in beta, it still is way better than uh, th than those other two. Even though, I mean, every now and then you'll run into, like, floating missiles or some, like, weird fire effects or weird, like, aircraft ambient maneuvers or hovering things. It's, I mean, yeah, there, there's a couple bugs here and there, but it's... It's getting patched really quickly. The, the, the pace of content and patches is excellent with this game. This guy right here, man, he just I, I, he keep playing like spotting peekaboo. It's like I keep reloading and thinking, okay, he's not gonna pop back out again, and he just keep, he keeps popping back up. Yeah, this guy in this camo peekaboo. Look at that. He can die already. And, 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 and kill stolen again. Big surprise. You know. Uh, you guys are dicks. <laughs> you guys are greedy, greedy dicks, all of you. <clears throat> so, while they're busy up there, it doesn't look like there's much over here, and we've already got guys already trying to flank, so I think I'll just join them and do what I can. I see something fast over there, yeah, the, the, the BMD, or BMP, or whatever it is. It, it, my screen is really small, so it's hard to see. But yeah, I, I see him running over there, so I decided to go after him and run him down. Now, arguably, I probably should have finished him off with chain gun, but this guy hit his back to me, and getting damage into him was just too much to uh, t t too much to pass up. And fire a missile, APS, fire another missile, and boom. That's why two missiles are better than one. Yep, look at that. <laughs> Like I said, I've redone the commentary on this one 20 times, and I just, I, I don't know what it is, I can't get it right. Boom. And that sucked. I, I, that, that one should have penned, but it didn't, whatever. And this guy, it just keeps, like, getting all these non-penning hits or tracking me and stuff, getting really unlucky. Uh, I should have arguably stayed with missiles right here, but, because he'd be dead right about now, but... I, uh, I switched back to gun, trying to get behind him, and then I remembered he's way too maneuverable. Get my missiles back up, boom. So now he's dead too. I didn't have to take that last shot. I could have avoided that. But you know what they say about hindsight in 2020. Um, yeah, this, uh, oh, look at that. You know what, I think we're almost to the, uh, jeez, I found 15 minutes worth of shit to ramble on about. How about that? Is it good? Well, you be the judge of that. I'm sick and tired of redoing it, so I'm probably just going to ship it as is. And then Far just jumps in the front of a stream of tracers and is yelling at me on, on TeamSpeak. Well, you know, bro, I didn't, I didn't throw you into a column of gunfire. You, know? you can very easily see that. I don't know why you, you jumped out there. Besides, it was a little bit of damage. It's not like it cost us the game or anything, so chill out. I'm trying to get some more damage into this guy. He's kind of hard to... Come on, back up, you son of a bitch. Back up. Come in. This loud. Come in. What? Oh, come on. Why are you going to be like that? That was a perfect side shot. You suck, game. You suck. All right, well, that's it for this video. If you guys want to see uh, anything else from me, um, feel free to comment. Maybe subscribe if you so feel inclined. Look through some of my other videos. Uh, and when you comment, let me know uh, what else you want to see. And I'll make a conscious effort to, uh, to make that kind of content and get it up there for you. Alright, there we go.